Hi, my name is Andrew. I'm from Flirtson, California, and I've been working in the food industry for 10 years now. My dream is to open up a restaurant in the future, and I've worked various jobs, starting from a dishwasher to up to a manager, and I thought in order to open a restaurant, I need the knowledge and the expertise to know how to cook and handle food. So I decided to apply to Sushi Chef Institute. I think the hardest part about coming here was having a lack of experience in cooking and knife skills. But with Andy Sensei's best knowledge, I was able to overcome even the hardest parts about like filleting the fish or using julienne to cut the, uh, the vegetables with constant practice. And that was something I enjoyed overcoming during the school. I did try to learn sushi from another chef, but I noticed the huge difference between Andy Sensei and the, uh, that chef. There are people out there that may know a lot about sushi, but are really bad at teaching it. Whereas Andy Sensei, he's really good at what he does, and he also is really good at teaching it, which makes it perfect for someone who wants to apply and learn more about sushi. My most memorable experience would be being able to closely connect with the classmates here. Um, at first, it was a little bit awkward because, you know, we're all meeting each other for the first time and trying to figure out who was going to be the top of the class. But I'm just like a goofy person and using, you know, my goofiness uh, throughout the whole class time and making everyone smile was probably my most memorable experience. One or two years, I would definitely see myself just finishing my job uh, at a sushi restaurant to apply to a probably a better restaurant to show them, you know, my skill and try to put myself out there so I can learn from uh, better chefs around the world.